Well, we're up. Barely. Saturday morning. It ain't Saturday morning. What are you talking about? Is it Tuesday? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Tuesday morning. I am so, so mixed up on my days. We are literally on a mancation on a Tuesday morning. What up, Noah? What up? Good morning. A little tired. Dude, you ain't lying. <laughs> Today we're going to be laying in 5,000 decoys that we didn't even have to sit one of them. Yay. So, <laughs> yes, um, of course, That's like, exciting. Ser seriously, that is so nice. I cannot wait to sit in that many decoys. Never sat in 5,000 decoys and for sure never sat 5,000 decoys and I'm glad. I get to do it the easy way. So. That's what we're headed to do. We're gonna go by the uh, little convenience store. And when we get to this big old giant spread, I'm gonna show you guys what it's all about. And we're gonna be checking it out. Yep. Good morning. What are you gonna get? I don't know. Good for your soul. there all right we are sat down here what we got going on here you cannot tell right here but on the edge of this decoy line right here at our feet it literally goes boosh I mean that is a steep steep hill very steep hill the birds that's a whole valley down there and they are literally eye level coming right to that hill I mean right in our face this is unreal I'll walk out there in a minute and show you guys exactly what I'm talking about this is, uh, this is JR, he's the owner here at Waterfowl Assassins and uh, just before we get started here, I'm going to let you guys know that if you guys watch this and you're interested in coming here, I will put the link to his outfitter in the description below. Go to the description, check it out. I'm telling you, this is an amazing, amazing place. Rolling hills. Yeah, we're sitting on a 90 yard tall hill if you're wanting to come out to northwest missouri if you're around it if you want to travel if you want a good snow goose hunt for conservation season get a hold of jr here we go that's a pretty 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 sunrise come on spin around spin around Everybody at once. Yep, there we go. <laughs> All right, here's our first good looking group. We've had specs give it up like usual, but uh, here's our first white bird of the day. Look at him, it just floating all up in here. Come over that hill, bang, bang. buddy yeah oh my goodness I like it I like it a lot already that's way too close for BB that was close that was nice and close holy smokes goodness we got the man himself this is Jameson the owner of snows down low but yes, this is Jameson. You all have heard me talk about Snows Down Low, and I'm sure a bunch of you have already went and checked it out. But he's friends with, with JR and um, invited us down on this uh, awesome Northwest Missouri hunt. And I have always wanted to come here. Look like jets. Yo! So these are the new Ducks face shields. If you haven't, oh god, I can't see ya. Oh, if you haven't went and checked them out, I'll link them in the description. There you go. And check out the new snow goose hoodies. We finally got them. What's your arm? What's your arm say, bud? No plugs, no limits. No plugs, no limits. Like the no limit soldiers. Yeah. 
Look at that feed. Oh my goodness. That there is a monstrosity. That's a lot of birds. You guys shoot singlet. Kill that bird. Kill him, Noah. Boom! That's a happy girl. I'm taking this. <laughs> wow. He was a couple pounds heavier. Yeah. So, I haven't really showed you guys, but if you can't tell, I mean, it is a muddy, absolute mess. And that bird's feet were completely caked in mud, made them about a pound heavier. The mud is horrendous. Goodness. Here we go, come on. How many feeds are there like that, that, that size around here? A lot. Yeah, a lot. That's like one feed for us. One feed? That's like three feeds combined. Yeah. I don't know, I might leave it in and just run BB. Well, we got two down. There we go. Here. Look at that. Here. Little juvie. Here. Got the birds yeah. give a name like water. Look at this, this is how muddy it is. That is dry mud, that's how he's been feeding. <coughs> Smoke the three. Yeah. All right, the full's going in. Jamie, many Christmas. Um, both, both times. You hit him once, Preston. What? That, you hit that goose once. Yeah. I think I hit him once too. Well, and they just now got off another feed, so trying to get them to feed again is going to be hard. They're wanting to uh, head right back to water right now, so. Trying to intrigue them to uh, decor right now is a little tough. My goodness, we got four really, really low coming at us. Oh, here they come. Get ready. Come on. Come over us. Pick that low one right there, Noah. There we go. Lily! We get four, five. We got one more coming in, though. Let's go. I see. One out front. Come. Right out front. Well, we are sat back down, we filled our bellies, done a bunch of talking, a bunch of gabbing, having a bunch of fun with these guys. We have an absolute awesome group of guys really enjoying this. It's fun. But uh, we have a couple singles working. It's a hair after four, and they are flying. It's I nice. fell asleep for about an hour or two. Did you? Yeah. It's like a lullaby. I know. Dude, I three, three to the left that might do it dirty. Well, might do it dirty. Right They're going to do it dirty, boy. <laughs> Got a good group today. Had a lot of fun today with these guys. Come on, let's do it. Come on, fellas. Get in here. They're here and they are working. They are flipping. Look at look at this single just getting in here hard. Oh, that's sweet. Oh, look at him coming in on the right. Double pounded here. <laughs> bang bang! Hey, group out front. So I we pulled. It. I didn't even know you shot. Yeah, we shot like we shot at the same exact time. Yeah. That's awesome. That was sweet. Look at this group of six coming out of us. Seven. Come on, single. Another single. Come on. Come on. Come on. What's up? 
Uh, sitting in Missouri with Bobby. Come on, get down. Oh, look, low, low, low right, low right. Kill it. On the end. Nice shot. Oh boy, Bobby. Uh, Woo! It's a, you know, it's Good deal. Here we go. Really? Two. That's it? <laughs> I wish we shell do that. Whoa. That's no go. You ever seen this before? Yeah, that happened uh, in Arkansas. Really? Here. 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 We're going to be on your ride again. We'll waste them. <laughs> One more for good luck. He gave him a little pat on the butt on the way down. Oh, dirty birdie. Here we go. I mean, these four got in here fast. Come on now. Don't let them leave. Golly. Of a gun, we got him. Not good out of here. Woo! Who smoked him on the second one? I don't know. I think it was a. I don't know. It was, it was a couple. <laughs> it was a joint effort. That was good. Let's kill all these. Oh yeah. Oh, hey, we actually got yeah. three of them. We got two long ones. That was a, those are long ones. Here. That's how you unload your guns for the day. That's yeah. how you unload it. I made it easy. <laughs> Woo! So, not a bad day at all. We're finally back here at the lodge and let me tell you what it's a nice little lodge i don't think i've got to show you guys inside much be looking out for the lodge footage in the next video long story short we ended the hunt you've seen the pile we shot 42 i believe tomorrow it's going to be a north wind there's a front coming through that north wind i guess here just makes a ton of difference because a lot of times when the birds get here you have warm steady south winds and they maintain, you know, they just get in a rhythm and they maintain a rhythm. And when they're doing that with that warm south wind, it just drives them north that much faster. So what we're hoping tomorrow is that this northern front is going to stall them a little bit and it's going to make them hungry. It's going to make them want to feed. So, so be looking out for the next video that I put out here with Waterfowl Assassins and JR. You met JR earlier. Great guy. He's been hunting snows for over 14 years years the dude i talked to him all day great guy you guys need to meet him if you guys want to come down here and hunt i'm telling you this time every year this time every year the end of february beginning of march jr has that sauce gets it done his spreads are massive the spread today was 5,000 decoys mostly socks but huge massive i've never even sat in that big of a spread you guys know i do 2,500 spreads at most. So it was huge. I mean, it was like sitting on another planet. Go check out JR and Waterfowl Assassins, his whole entire guide service. I'll leave his link down in the description. Go check it out. He is the man for the white birds. Thank you guys for watching. Subscribe if you have it. If you like these conservation snow hunts, drop me a like and let me know. I'm gonna be doing them more. I'm gonna be doing, I love it. I, I am learning and learning. I'm learning. I'm learning the biology of these birds and just loving every second of it. It's a new addition to what I'm learning in waterfowl and I'm loving every second of it. I, I, I urge you guys to step out of your comfort zones. Step out of your comfort zones with public duck hunting. Like I've said before, get in the field, do some field scouting, try some snows. You can always try. You gotta have a bunch of decoys, I'm not gonna lie. You gotta have a bunch to get these things down. It's a struggle, you guys seen it. Thank you for watching guys, we'll see you on the next one. Peace. Yeah, guala, 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 guala. I'm living like it's no tomorrow. Don't know my style, won't let you borrow.
You're thirsty, have a glass of water. I'm killing these beasts that be more dead.